Weight Watchers weigh in and giveaway winner announced today on Mima McLiving Healthy. Stay tuned. Hello. As I said in my intro, today's topic is Weight Watchers Weigh-In and the giveaway winner will be announced in today's video. As most of you know, a few weeks ago I started a giveaway because I was celebrating my milestone of reaching 500 subscribers, so I wanted to give back and I started this giveaway. It ended at 11.59.59 on November the 30th. So I got up in the middle of the night and drew a winner. That will be later in the video. First of all, I'm gonna talk about my weigh-in this morning. Last Thursday, I weighed in at 114.5. Six. Now that was when I first got up. It was Thanksgiving morning and I knew that I was probably going to eat quite a bit that day. And I did. I, did, I didn't uh, surprise myself. I, as I shared in my last video, I ate all my dailies for lunch and dipped into a lot of my weeklies. Well, dipped into all my weeklies. Uh, so I was in an uphill battle the rest of the week, but that's okay. I had planned for it. I didn't plan on eating as much as I did, but I still had a plan in place. And because of that, I realized that I was okay and that I could sort of make up for it during the week. I did. I weighed in the middle of the week on Monday and I weighed 114.6. That's the same as I had weighed Thursday on Thanksgiving. And I really tried to eat what I knew that I needed to be eating. A lot of vegetables. I cannot say enough praise about this new program. The reward points for the vegetables, it has really invigorated me to want to be successful on this new program. The personal points program, I really think it's a great idea. If you are not on Weight Watchers, consider it. You can get a free month. I, I have that down in the description, but you can also, Weight Watchers is always running specials, so go to their website and you can find out a lot of information about how you can get sometimes up to three months free if you join. They normally do that at the first of the year. They did it right after the new program came out, but right now, I think it's just a little bit of a, you pay $10 a month or something like that. Anyway, to get back to my weigh-in, this morning, I got on the scale. I was not looking forward to getting on the scale, but as I have said many times, whether I'm looking forward to it or not, I still get on the scale. That's just something I do. It's part of my routine. I don't get all upset if I gain weight but I do learn from it. Well, I got on the scale this morning and I weighed in at 113.6. How that happened, I don't know. This is the first time in years that I have lost weight during the week of Thanksgiving. I ended up losing exactly one pound from last Thursday to this Thursday. Now, Will I do that every week? I sure hope not, because I'm gonna dry it and blow away if I lose much more weight. I'm within six tenths of a pound of losing a total of 100 pounds since I started Weight Watchers in 2014. That's exciting for me. I have reached that before, but I'm not determined to reach it anymore. Uh, so I just tell you whatever my weight is, and today it was 113.6. Now, to get on to the giveaway winner. Before I give you her name, yes, 
it is a woman. That's a little bit of a hint. I want to go over the things that I'm giving uh, in this giveaway. Uh, they're all things that I use quite often. And if I achieve the thousand subscribers in the next few months, which I'm really hoping to do, there will be another giveaway. So stay tuned for that. But these are the gifts that she will receive. Now she has to email me her mailing address, but I'll go into that after I reveal her name. But here are some of the things, the two silicone whisk. I use a whisk at least four or five, maybe even six times a week. Uh, and I love the silicone because it doesn't scratch my cookware, whatever I'm using. Spatulas, very important. A small melamine spoon. Use it all the time. Not this one, but the one that I have. All of this, but a couple of things can all be purchased at Walmart. These are my quarter cup measuring cups. They are broken up into tablespoons and a fourth of a cup and an eighth of a cup and uh, ounces, two ounces. I use this all the time. My favorite sprayer, it's my Evo sprayer. I put my olive oil in this. Each spray, one quarter of a teaspoon. My favorite mix that I add to my water keeps me from having leg cramps. It's Propel. A book that has been a lifesaver for me this year. As I mentioned, Monday we had another loss in the family. I've had to refer back to this book to get my joy back. It, it's been tough. These last couple of years have been tough to have any kind of joy. And this, this book, I, I cannot say enough praise about it. Uh, Tommy Newberry, he did a great job in this book. And it just takes 40 days and a little bit more. And then the last thing in the giveaway is a $20 gift card from Walmart to buy any other things that you feel like you would like to have. Okay, drum roll, please. I'm going to announce the winner now. Now, I tried to be so professional in all of this. I got up a little bit after midnight on uh, December the 1st and was going to film uh, everything about me picking the winner. I have a uh, extension on my computer called TubeBuddy, and it facilitates me in being able to pick a winner. And so, oh, I was going to be just so good at it. Well, I guess with it being a few minutes after 12 midnight, I wasn't awake enough <laughs> to really do a great job. Tried to film it with my GoPro, and that's what I'm filming this right now. Failed miserably at that. And then finally, I just got my old trusty iPhone out and filmed it. Now, is it a perfect video? No. But it's still a video. So, I may talk over the video, but probably won't. I'll be back in just a minute after I play you the video. Okay, as you saw, the winner was Linda Manning. Now, Linda, if you're out there, or if Linda's friends are out there watching this, get in touch with me. And the way that you get in touch with me is emailing me. My email address is in the description box. 
and send me your mailing address. It has to be in the United States, and it cannot be a post office box. And I'll get those prizes to you as soon as possible. My email address is mimamac7 at gmail.com. That's M E E M A M and the number seven at gmail.com. Congratulations, Linda. I hope you enjoy the things you're going to get as much as I do almost daily. By the way, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. Press the notification bell so you'll get everything and share if you like it. Oh, and don't forget to comment below too. Goodbye.